Hello everyone, welcome to BK Engineering. In free hypermesh training, today let's do an assignment on importing, checking and repairing a 3D CAD model. So the objective of this model is to delete untrimmed surfaces, close the missing gap and delete the duplicate surfaces and equivalence free edges. Okay, so let's get started. So first let me open hypermesh. Okay, and once hypermesh is open, let me import the file called cliprepair.hm open once the cat model is open so our first step will be to go to auto cleanup in auto cleanup you can see there are few uh, if i'll go to visualize this option as well now you can see over here we have few errors the red color indicates that we have few holes or gaps to be filled and non-manifold yellow color indicates that we have duplicate surfaces where one surfaces share with other edges as well so we have to delete that duplicate surface and for now we don't have suppressed edges so we have to delete that as well for now we don't have so we don't have to do that okay so we'll go to model and go to return so first let's trim the untrimmed surface okay so when you go to delete entity and press to this surface sorry convert this into surface surf and select this surface if but this surface is not split so what we'll do is first go to surface edit then go to trim with line okay in trim with line select with line surface select this surface and for, for free line select the surface edge and then select this edge sorry right click and select this edge if you along the vector change that into normal to surface and then trim so now we have split this to surface now when we go to delete entity and select this surface and delete so we have deleted the untrimmed surface return but now we can observe that we still have a red color line that means that we do have a uh, gap over here so for that what we'll do is return go to quick edges and go to toggle edge select line in line select this line then it will be back to green color okay return this toggle option is easier when the gap is small but there are few options when you go to surface you can see over here there are few surfaces which is uh, we can't do with the toggle option so what we'll do is we'll select spline filler option and uncheck keep tangency and keep line end and check auto create and select any one of the line and by default it will convert uh, it will repair the uh, surface okay return <coughs> so we have repaired for now we have uh, closed the gap and the surface as well so our next option will be to go to preference and then in preference select geometry options in geometry option cleanup tolerance convert that into 0.01 enter return set global geometry in cleanup tolerance 0.1 we have done with this now let's go to combine multi free for that let's go to surface edge edge edit and then select equivalence in equivalence in surface select all and for cleanup tolerance we have given 0.1 and select equivalence so now we can observe all the red gap is gone now we have few edges to be repaired for that let's go to toggle in toggle edge cleanup convert that into one and then select the edges so now you can see we have repaired this edge as well so now we have 
this gap to be filled for that what we'll do is let's go to replace okay in moved edge select this left red line and for retain edge select the right line and for clean up tool give it as 0.2 and replace yes so now you can see we have replaced all the uh, missing gaps okay we have closed all the missing gap so we can return so our next step will be to delete the duplicate surface so for that what we'll do is we'll go to defixtures in defixtures select duplicates in surface select all and find once we found all the duplicate surface we have two surface over here so we can delete those surfaces now we can return now once we go to by topo we can see over here that all the repair uh, all the missing surface is repaired and all the deleted surfaces uh, sorry duplicated surfaces de deleted so by this we have repaired the cat model so let's conclude this assignment here let's meet in next session thank you if you like the video please like share and subscribe if you want to learn any courses regarding mechanical engineering please click the link in the description